My name is Paul Salsuter. My expected year of graduation is 2018, and I'm a studio art and art history major. So the main theme of the project is the natural history of science and the natural history of the universe. So there, there's one section that's devoted to a timeline from the Big Bang up into the birth of human consciousness. The actual planning of this uh, started in May and it went all the way up through the beginning of July, which uh, the beginning of July was when the actual painting of the mural started. And by then the content was pretty much planned. I haven't really worked with anyone uh, in the art department on this mural, actually. I've received some uh, comments and critiques here and there from the other art faculty. Uh, but mostly this has all been, uh, Professor Erlen Wheeler has been the primary advisor to this project. I don't like to, to put up my artwork without knowing what I'm doing most of the time. So I, I found it was very important to, to try to study uh, everything that I was putting up so that I had sort of a thorough understanding going into it. Already what I've incorporated in this mural has been uh, some collage. I was able to to take and, and rip up the notes and pieces of paper and collage them into, into Einstein's face actually. So all of the highlighting on Einstein's face is all done in student notes. The gold leafing is used very, very sparingly. There's only a few sections where it's going to come up at all. There are a few really, really key moments and really key proofs that are going to be done in gold leaf. Uh, one is the first proposition of Euclid, and another is the number zero, which is so incredibly important to the history of mathematics that I just had to, to put it in gold. The idea that you could have a, a placeholder for valuelessness. Uh, another section I'm really, really excited for, though, is uh, the creation of life, which is one that's going to use almost all of the techniques. Uh, it's going to use painting, it's going to use printmaking for DNA, it's going to use gold leafing, it's going to incorporate some really uh, interesting aspects that are very scientific in, in that they're going to be very illustrative of how cell life probably most likely has originated. Well, I, I would definitely say one of the parts that I actually enjoy most is, is the process of actually putting it up. There was an option in doing this mural of just having me paint on canvas in the studio or in, in my studio over in the JAC. You know, that would, have been, that would have been fine. It would have been a 400 foot long painting. I would have just done uh, sitting by myself alone in a room. <laughs> but that just did not feel right to me. And I, I think the great part about a mural is that you get to to live in the space where it's going to be in and you get to interact with the the people in that space and you get to, to talk with with people and and more importantly people get to to see the mural go up and see the day-by-day -day changes that are going on and and it really involves people with the process and, and makes them kind of grounded to the space a little bit it makes the space feel special 